In this video, I will show how to add decals and logos to a 3D model. I will show both way to add it to the basic materials and PBR texture. Let's get started. Here is a Blender logo that I will use that has a transparent background, but you can use any image or logo to accomplish this process. Now let's go into the Blender. Let's activate Node Wrangler just by going to Edit, Preference. In the Add-in section, search for Node Wrangler and make sure you tick the box. Here I have this pillow model, but you can use any model to add a decal or logo. I will switch to the Shading tab, go to the Shading Editor, then add Add New Material in the principled BSDF. I will change the base color. This looks great to me. Select your image texture, drag it, and place it in the Shader Editor. With the image node selected, press Ctrl plus T. This will automatically add the texture coordinate and mapping node. Press Shift plus A. Let's add Diffuse BSDF. Select the color of the image and plug that into Diffuse Color. And after that, we need a mix shader. Connect the output of the principal BSDF to the first shader. Take this BSDF and connect it to the second shader. I will take this shader and connect it to the surface of the material output. Now we see the logo has added to our model, but it doesn't look great. To fix this, we need to unwrap the model. I will go into edit mode, then select these edges. Right click and mark seam. I will change this window to the UV editor. I will collapse this window to have space to work with. Press A to select all, then press U to unwrap. I will scale the island to the correct alignment of the logo. To fix the repetition of the logo, in the image node, change repeat to clip. I want to change the position of the logo. I will move the island to find the right position. Now it looks great, but we have a problem with texture. Doesn't look good at all. To fix this, take image alpha and connect it to the factor of the mix shader. Now everything looks realistic. I will duplicate this model to show how to add decay or logo to the PBR texture. I will use fabric textures. Duplicate the texture. In this case, we don't need diffuse BSDF and mix shaders. I will delete them. Take BSDF, then connect it to the surface of the material output. Now I will add the PBR texture. With principal BSDF selected, press Ctrl plus Shift plus T. I will select all the PBR textures, then add the principled texture setup. I will increase the scale value of the texture to 3. To add our logo to the model, add Mix RGB. Drag it here to connect the base color and principal BSDF. Take the color of the logo texture, then connect it to color 2 of Mix RGB. Also, take image alpha and connect it to the factor of the mix shader. Now it looks much more realistic. This method can be used with different textures to add logos and decals to any model. That is it for this tutorial. I hope you have enjoyed it and learned something. If you do, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.